So I'm Cara Vaughan and I received the Ian Gould Experimental Science Grant. So I was looking at sociality in the desert skink, like Olatin or Nata, down on the Eyre Peninsula in South Australia. And I was trying to work out whether they are social because they're considered fairly antisocial. And I did find that they were social to some degree. They actually share burrows a lot. They don't live solitary lives as first expected. And in, in a lot of journals, uh, people have actually wrote about them being very solitary. And I found that they were sharing burrows extensively, not forming distinct groups as such, but a few of the animals I found were actually coming back together after some time. So there were some associations, they weren't close associations, but they were sharing a lot of space together. So the Ian Gold grant helped me a lot because I had to go out into the field, spend a lot of time out in the bush near Wyala, and I had to get to my study site, I had to be able to come back often, and also just driving around within my study site. Uh, took a fair bit of um, fuel money, and I also needed to buy all my field gear, and I also needed to buy over $900 worth of traps. It helped me a lot um, because I was under pressure economically, so it, it just made the whole process much more enjoyable. I could get all my gear. I heard about it just via email, so it was sent around to various students. I got a phone call, I was actually interstate with work, and I got a phone call saying that I'd got it and it just made me very relieved uh, and pleased that I'd, that I'd spent a fair bit of time on the application. So, And I knew my work was going to be good, but I needed someone else to appreciate it as well, so that was nice. So I enjoyed catching up with Ian Gould, actually, uh, and I just wanted to say thank you to him for, for giving me a chance because um, just someone appreciating your work and being passionate about your work as well. It was wonderful that we could have a long chat about my project um, because sometimes you do feel a bit alone in your project. So it was nice to, to hear uh, his encouragement. So I just encourage students to look at the scholarship website to see what, what different scholarships are available and have a look, have a good look. Spend some time before you start your research to have a good look about what you're eligible for.